What's, What's up, up, my bearded people? people? All right, so something very different than anything else we've done. The holiday season now is upon us. Uh, this is actually one of my wife's, and actually probably is my wife's favorite Christmas song, basically. Um, it's really, really interesting, and I'm not going to try to spoil too much for you with it. It's basically the breakdown of a, a, this Christmas song, in a way. So... Uh, my wife was an acapella singer in college, so she really appreciates the different instrumental portions or the different portions that make up a song. So this one le leads really well to what her likes are. And uh, it's a beautiful song. So I know it's very popular and it's something that uh, she loves. And just want to share it with you since I obviously have seen this. I'm curious to see what you think about this as somebody who's been in band like myself before. I'm just assuming it's four people. You'll see. Or either they got some like weird amputees. Yeah, exactly. Like, guys <laughs> exactly. <laughs> nah, it's really neat though. So, and we're going to watch this one the entire way through because there's not a place to pause. <laughs> interesting um I, th I think is uh, probably the thing that i take away from this the most is i think everybody forgets that a piano is a string instrument <laughs> yeah you just think it's something you press a button and it makes a sound yes you, you don't think about it hammering down onto the string yeah um and i and i was actually thinking about this the other day i saw someone str uh, uh strum a harp yeah and 
for whatever reason, like you said, we've been in band seven years of band. Yeah. And it just dawned on me that a harp is basically just like an upright piano. Yeah. That without the hammer. And it's so funny we see this because now it's like it's like looking at a an autopsy of a piano basically and they're playing with the different parts of it. All of it's a piano. Yeah. I think that it's amazing just how, how all it took to make this song possible. Everything from breaking the violin boat down to plucking the uh, core, you know, the, what's the word I'm for, looking for? The, the string. Strings, thank you. The strings on the piano. I, I wonder how long it took them just to think how to make this song. I can I tell you right now, this, this was probably some like quarter in project that, that that they've built on for the last 20 or 30 years. Yeah. Like, cause this is the ultimate high school band kid, you know, the, 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 what's the right way to put this? The, the, the nerdy, the geeking out moment for yeah, a band kid. The, yeah. the geeked out band kid moment. Yes. That's, that's what this is. This is just four people who are, who love what they do. Yes. Everything about what they do. do. Yeah. They live this. This look they all look like they're having just so much fun. The choreography in this is beyond uh, three and a half minutes does not give it justice. I could listen to it for so much longer. I wish it was a longer song. Well even listening to it, I mean and I, I don't mean this in any negative way. The the sounds aren't special because it's piano. Yeah. The special part is how they've created the sounds. sounds. Yeah. You, you need the video to understand how amazing this is. Because otherwise yeah. it just sounds like maybe a couple pianos. Yeah, exactly. But then when you realize it's four guys having to move in a specific transitioning, playing one instrument like that. Changing foot, ch changing feet on yeah. the pedals of the piano. You know. Playing the percussion inside the piano. You know. Using a piece of paper to get the snare sound. With a picture of a drum, <laughs> drum on it. Yeah. <laughs> Just, it's amazing to watch the breakdown of music. Like I said, I figured this is something that you would appreciate, like myself, as being someone in band and do seeing this. Great, Just, great audio engineering as well. Yeah, the, the the this finished product sounds amazing. Yeah, just awesome song. I feel, and it sounds like you agree with me. So, and the room that they're in could not have been designed for anything other than Christmas. <laughs> like, no it's kidding. legitimately just like a Christmas haul. It's 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 beautiful. Yes, it's so perfect. I, I, I like the video of the setup. Very yeah, whimsical. Yeah, um, just hanging on the stocking. You got on the dog that's walking in. You put it on the little train that's going around. Vader going <laughs> holding it, it. Yeah, it's just got like it. It's one of those very carefree, warm Christmas videos. Joy. It, yeah, it's 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 very well put together all around yeah. yeah well tell us what y'all thought down below i'm glad there was no amputees i'm glad all these guys have all their hands and fingers <laughs> yes absolutely. i was sitting here doing the math like okay eight thumbs 32 is that eight uh, yeah <laughs> i was sitting here doing the math throwing us off of it with 31 fingers or something yeah, that's crazy like, uh which one was in the war <laughs> which one lost the finger <laughs> sawing accident <laughs> yeah, exactly well, tell us. I got too close to the robot dog, and no oh, shit. All right, thirty-one fingers. Uh, elf on the shelf got that figure. Thanks, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> tell us what you thought of this down below. If there's anything you'd like us to react to, that's a little bit different than what we do. Uh, but hey, we'll absolutely be happy to do more like it. But anyway, catch y'all next time. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all.